Hi, uh, this video is about um, logic gates. So I'm using the uh, LabVIEW here. LabVIEW is the software that National Instrument makes. So there are, I'm going to cover uh, seven gates, NOT, AND, uh, NOT AND, or you can call as an AND, OR, NOR, NOR, uh, XOR, and XNOR. Okay, so these are the seven basic gates. Uh, these gates, uh, they are used in uh, many integrated circuit ICs and uh, many electronic circuit. And uh, these ICs and um, these chips, they use on many places, on many applications. Okay, so let's start with the, on these gates here. So I'm going to run, so this is the front panel and this is the uh, block diagram in a lab view. So if uh, I'm going to run in a continuous mode here, okay. So now, NOT gate and the the, the table for the NOT gate is like uh, when switch is uh, off, output will be one, and when I turn the switch on, output will turn off. Okay, so that's the NOT gate. If you look at the NOT gate, it will look something like this. So whatever you give the input, it will make uh, it will make it um, negative of it. Uh, um, or negate it. Um, so if I give one here, it will make zero here, and if I give zero, it will make one. Okay, so that's a NOT gate. Um, AND gate. Uh, so AND gate. This is a two table for the AND gate. Um, when both switch position are zero zero, output will be zero. Um, when one switch position is one, output will be still be zero. Uh, switch one is one, output is still zero. To make the output one, uh, the both input has to one here. Okay, so this is the. Let me go here. So this is the end gate. So this is what the end gate look like. Uh, it has two input and one output. Okay, and um, to run the simulation, I'm going to this. Both switches are in zero zero position. Now if I make the switch to one. Uh, that's the second one. Output is still zero. Um, now I'm going to, if I make switch one as a one, still output zero. Now if I make both switch one, then output will be one. Okay, so that's the end gate. Uh, now NAND gate is the exact opposite of this one. So this is a simulation of the NAND gate. Um, zero zero is output one. Zero one, uh, basically, uh, when both switch input are one, then output will be zero here. So the other case, uh, output will be one. Okay, so I make the both switch one. There is the exact opposite. We just saw in the end gate. Okay, if I make any switch on, uh, output will be one. Okay, so that's the end gate. Um, this is the OR gate. And if I go back here in my case uh, structure, this is the OR gate. Look like this. Um, any input is one, output will be one. Okay, so both zero, output will be zero. But here switch two is one, output will be one. Switch one, output is one, and one one is equal to one. Okay, so to run it, uh, both are in off. If I make any switch on, output will be on, and if I leave both switch on, okay. So that's the OR gate. Uh, NOR gate is exact opposite of it. So when both switch are zero, it will be one. Um, one z uh, zero one will be zero zero zero. Okay, so that's what it is. Uh, both switch are in off position. Output is one. If I make any switch on, then the output will be uh, zero. Okay, and uh, if you go to the table, this is what the NOR gate look like. So this is a symbol. So basically, what uh, it just applied the the NOT function to the OR gate. Okay, so that's the NOR gate. Now this is the exclusive exclusive OR gate. So uh, here the truth table, when both input are zero, output is zero. When both input are one, output is still zero. Okay, so that's the XOR gate. And then let's say if I, in the simulation, if I make this one, output is one. This switch two, output is one. Now if I make both switch one, output will be zero. Okay, so XNOR gate is a 
is a is a not gate of the XOR. So if I go here and if I show the X and okay, so this is what the XOR gate look like. We just saw earlier, and now we are in the XNOR gate. So let me go back here, XNOR gate, and you just add the negative sign here. And as you can see, this small circle here, that's the making the ne negative of the XOR gate. Okay, so now here, the truth table for this one is um, if both zero, output will be one. Zero one, output will be zero. One zero is zero, and one one is equal to one. So to simulate, let's say both. If I make one switch on, this is the condition here one zero output is zero and same thing if I make any switch turn on output will be off so now this is the the gates uh, they are used in electronic industry and uh, hopefully you learn about the logic gates uh, if you like this video subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching